Bum, 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 bum. Hi. Hi. We're back again for the second part of this master hall. Master hall or major hall? Massive hall. Massive hall. <laughs> okay, let's get started. Okay. Action. first uh, video the first video below so you can go watch the first one if you missed it right right okay wow look at these cute cute felt little birds there are four of them in here oh it's taped up so you can still see it through there so there's four cute felt little birds there are they darling they're so darling little ornaments or whatever or just knickknacks Think those are handmade? Yes. Tim Tim? Yes, I think they're handmade. I think so too. I'm gonna get some Halloween, I mean some uh, holiday stuff out of the way. I picked up this. This was full of little knickknacks, so you know I just grabbed the whole Sorry. thing because it was I liked I don't know if this is old or not. I don't know how you can really tell. 80, 1980, it says it on here. That's how you can tell. And it had, had a little bat on it. Ain't that cute? Let me get some stuff out of the way. Tim Tam found this music sheet, this little ditty called Rain on the Roof. And it's a local piece by a local artist by Edith DeWitt, written for Freddie McCrate. And her publishing company is in Paris, Paris, Texas. Oh, I was going to say, you said it was local. <laughs> I guess that is local. And I don't know what this is. It's a little wooden, um, has a box on the back. It's maybe a planter or hold some candy canes or something, but I thought it was cute. Just a little Christmas decor. And Tam Tam bought a box of family photos. All various poses and dates and some... I didn't buy that box. Oh. Yeah, I did. <laughs> did she stole the box? <laughs> Just a nice photo. Bear Creek School. I like that one. The old school class photo. Look at that old truck. Fouts Grocery. Miss Maybell. I can't show that one. <laughs> it's got some nice poses in here. I thought I'd show that first because it's flat and I can lay it down with other things. Here we have a nice uh, tin can. I like the colors on this. All the little trees. I bought this because it had these little... Uh, Disney characters in here. Well, well, all the Disney characters are gone. It had uh, the rescuers, the two little rescuer mouse, and the mice. three mice from Cinderella. And my son came over today and took them. But that's okay, because I bought this tin full of all these little ornaments for those rescuers to give to him. And so he got here before I was able to show the haul. So here are the few little pieces that are left. There was two little felt bears in there. That little uh, root reindeer. And then these cute little angels. Have little paper covers. Cute, cute. And a cool little tin. I like this tin. I'm gonna sneeze. Pew, pew. Uh, here's a nice little, was 5 by 7 frame, Tim? 4 by 6 5 by 7 5 by 7 Very ornate. Doesn't come with the back, obviously. 
she's pretty enough to put in a frame. Next, I'll get this, this out of the way, is a nice salt, pepper, and jam, I assume, Tam? Jam. Jam of tomatoes on a leaf base. These are the salt and peppies, and it's missing a little spoon. It's a nice, cute little set. It was cute, cute. There's our first cute, cute of 2024. <laughs> and look at this. This is really cool. It lights up. I tried it. It's a plastic Christmas tree on its own little stand. So, yeah, sorry this date, this came too late. Uh, it was after Christmas when I got this anyways, right? Yeah, it was so. after Christmas anyway. It was... The first weekend or the second weekend of January, I got this. But I love it. I've never seen one of these before. She's never seen one of those before. So I haven't looked it up to see really how old it is, but I thought it was fun. That fun, fun. Tam Tam bought these chalkware. Oh. Mermaids. Those are a keeper. Now they're not studio, Miller, uh, studio. Miller studio, but. But. I'm, I didn't care. I needed I needed some mermaids to go with my fishies. Avert your eyes. <laughs> so I don't know how much newer they are. They're they look like they might be a project piece, but I was so happy to get those. Were you? Those came from uh, Glen Floor where. Sweet Treats and Pretties uh, has a booth. Carolina Sweet Treats and Pretties. Carolina Sweet Treats and Pretties. Okay, so here I have these little cookie cutters. Here's an Easter one. The little stamp cookie cutters and the three little pigs. Look at them, aren't those cute? And, oh, let me move the, my the, sticker. The sticker, is your sticker is, in the way? It's a Easter, Easter egg with a bunny coming out. And this one is just a piggy's face. Look at that. Cute, cute. And here's Tammy's new pillow. Here lives a wild, wacky, wonderful woman. Yes. Let Charlie hold it. Hold that, Charlie. Charlie Batman. Well, I I had <sighs> grabbed this thinking it was that ticking fabric, and it was a cool Ralph Lauren. I never heard. Hello. I never heard it tick. Tick, tick, tick. And it has its cool little buttons. It's already formed into the pillow. It has a pillow in it. So, I like it. I waited for her to hit me with that. Did it hurt? Here's a fun little beaded bag. Very heavy. Tammy got this at an estate sale. It has minor issues on it. But that just shows its age. Very decorative. Very heavy beads. Just show that one little part that's messed up right there. It's right here on the edge seam. Somebody at Sews can repair that. Still really pretty. Very pretty. And they're hard to come by. Three roses. And here I got some linens. Let me show you these real quick. If these don't sell, I might cut them up. But there's nothing wrong with these. I think there's two yellow ones and two of those blue ones. Oh, no, there's more of the yellow ones. Here's another blue. Here's another yellow. There's three yellow, two blue, three blue, four blue, and three, four yellow. So it's like, I guess these are placemats. Fabric placemats. So we have those. And then I have a pair of these. 
These are like what you would put on your arm of your chair that are knitted. I mean, not knitted, but um, embroidered of the lady in her outfit dress. This, I don't know, what does this go on the back of the chair by the neck, maybe? I don't know. I've never had these before. You know, my mom didn't use these either. Little square crochet um, and two pink dually. They're small. And we have this. Oops. This linen that's got this design on the bottom in yellow trim. And then this one is in a green trim. <sighs> oh, that hurt my arms. <laughs> Here is a metal with a plastic platform American family scale and it does have a spin regulator right here to make sure you get it back to zero the little black knob behind the dial it weighs pounds by ounces up to 11 kilograms 50 grams or 5 kilograms and it's not legal for trade Here's some heavy glass, Murano style design on a nice heavy base. And it has an acid signature of spirit. And this is this would make a nice shelf, shelf display of beautiful art glass. Has a nice green and crimson color. And that would make a nice addition to any library or study. Also, we have this large cocktail shaker. And this has dry martinis, old fashioned, you know, it has the ingredients for Manhattan's, daiquiri, a whiskey sour, all the way up to 24 ounces to this line where my thumb is. 24 ounces and have fun you got a nice chrome top and you can have plenty of fun mixing your favorite drinks or do a mix and drink it all yourself here i found some uh packs of buttons some jars jars of buttons i think i have four of these this one Looks like it might have a rock in it. <laughs> Looks like a rock right there. So, four jars of buttons is what I have. They're, the other two are somewhere. Now, I found a set of four of these very handsome uh, tees. And these are uh, Images Green. That's a tape with these olive mixers. It came with two olive blown glass mixers. Yeah, only cocktail two. Cocktail mixers. And um, very nice shape, very retro retro design. These are not particularly old, but they're by Gorham Crystal. And the color is Images Green. And I have a set of four, and those will come with two hand-blown glass olive cocktail stirs. We got this little ceramic chicken and this little owl toothpick holder with the toothpicks in it. I don't know if this is supposed to go with it like that. Is that how it works? I don't know. But this is going to be, otherwise I don't know what goes in here. Um, I got this in a lot, so this is going to go in my small cell. Some playing cards. You know, I thought these were tarot cards. <laughs> They're not. No. They're Tarot. They're a cousin of them. I'm not sure how you play those, though. Oh, yeah. I don't... Mm, I don't get that. And not all of the suits are in there. Oh, you checked it? Yeah. Aw. They're missing cards. Aw. But they make great... Uh, Toppers or junk journaling. Or if you're going to tag at a... Uh, tag at a... Sale. Like round top or something. You can use those for your uh, prices on larger items. That's what I would do. 
So sadly, you know, you don't always sit there in the store and count the cards, but I thought they were different. This nice little espresso set is from Crown Corning. Crown Corning Dimensions. And it's tempered glass, and that makes a nice little espresso set. Very, it's an octagon. Enter the octagon, Mr. Espresso. Enter, enter the octagon. The octagon. It was a Bruce Lee, and was it the octagon? The octagon. Yeah. Kung Fu movies. Come on, Tam. Work with me. I can make something up. I'm good at that. Don't do it. <laughs> Look at this cute little giraffe. It is a pepper shaker. It has its uh, bottom in there, but it's underneath. It, I mean, it's inside. But I only have the P. We don't have the S. But he's still cute. He's such a cute little what dot. I thought he was a little toy, but he's a shaker. He's a really tall shaker, too. So I got him anyways. And one more designer cup and saucer. That's a little bit bigger. Yeah, it's a rounded square. Rounded square. Oh, it's a rounded square. A yeah, rounded, rounded square. square. Oh. I mean, I would I would have fights if I was in elementary. <laughs> Very uh, modern design. This is from Joe Colombo, Italian. And these uh, this design was made in the sixties. Mid 60s to early 70s. Very neat design. I have, did I get two of these or one? There's two, there's a pair of those. Yeah, I have a pair of these. Whatever you did with it. It's somewhere, I just, I put it back there, I guess. Look, it is just a ceramic yellow. Is this a tiger? Tiger, right? It's a tiger. Not a, well, not a lion. What's the other one? It's a Bengal Pamper. tiger. Bengal? He's really large. It's not the ones that I collect. I've been collecting the panthers, black panthers. I think I'm done with black panthers. So, but he's fun. Really cute. Really cute guy. Crazy face. Crazy eyes. And Tammy picked up. What did I pick up? Oh, they were fun. Oh, she bathing. I think so. Some vintage matches, matchbox matches. I got some more in there too. Okay, picked up some risque matchbooks. Some are with a club. Uh, some have pretty cool graphics. <laughs> I didn't really notice it. I just saw matches and I picked them up. <laughs> they only had two bags, so I grabbed both. Um, Little cartoons, Maxie's car Tavern and Cafe. We picked these up in a little town in Texas. So uh -huh. those are always fun. Uh, the old Lady Lady with house. graphics. And Tammy picked up this project piece. I love four, that piece. Four leaves. And I'm holding this very tight. And is what's this spatter? Spatter Ladder. speckle? Yeah, speckled splatter. Speckled splatter design. And a very good design because they got it inside of there and glazed. So it's probably a shop that did this, not an individual. Now, only one leaf has a little issue. Right there. You can see the chip on it. Other than that, the rest of them look good. So I well, got them anyways. I did see the teeny, little chip. Teeny, teeny flea bite on the small one. I mean, oh, okay. that teeny I didn't notice bite. that one. I mean, you can barely see it. You can feel it, but you can barely see it. But they're but cool. For as old as these are, those are survivors. Here I got some little brooches, some holiday brooches. We have, um, they're plastic. I don't know, these Hallmark or Avon? I don't see the marking. So we have a snowman. We have a... A turkey. We have a cute little mouse. Cute little mouse. And a little bear. And a bear in a stocking. And those are all pins. And then this little gnome guy. 
I remember my mom having these and little plastic and they would have a hoe or a rake or something and you'd put these in your planners. I must have saved him because I only found one. That one? Yeah, there was only one. I must have saved him and I must have got a deal on him, but it's a nice cordial, nice stem. It's Faustoria's. See that design? Faustoria's Richmond Needle Etch. Very beautiful design. Can't wait to put my Dr. Pepper in here. Well, you know, I'm a thrifter. I Are had you? I had uh, found these and decided I had so many toys for the kids for Christmas. I thought I'd just hold on to these to give for a birthday present. They're not old, but they're cute. I thought they they would like those. There's a green, an orange, red. Let me get the other two out. I don't know nothing about them. And blue and red. They're creepy. They're creepy, they're little dinosaurs. Are they supposed to hang like that? Do dinosaurs hang that way? I guess they can. Little bat dinosaurs, aren't they? So. Tammy found this little fisherman bank, coin bank. It has a stopper. I guess it's to save up for your little fishing trip. It's, it's one of those paper machés. Like my collection. Is it though? <laughs> Here yeah. I have, y'all remember these nets, bag nets? I remember these young, uh, when we would go like to the pool or something, this is something mom would take so she could put all of our wet clothes or towels and stuff in there. And they would, uh, they could dry through that because it's mesh. Y'all remember these? I got a couple of these. Those are great beach bags. Yeah. She would use it for the I guess pool. Tammy picked up this camera photographer's ornament. It got a little bling I to think it. it was in a bundle of something. Here I have a orange round, plain orange round tablecloth. I didn't do the measurements beforehand, but um, nice and big it looks like. Crazy. Gotta be careful. Kind of like one. a bark cloth. A soft bark cloth. That's something you picked up. Yeah. I picked this up because I was going to make a Grinch uh, triangle person, you know, for my craft. Like, never got around to it. I'll try it again later. This is a nice old bottle with a glass stopper and I have it taped so it doesn't fall off. It's a very ornate bottle. And I'll show you the graphics. I think it's it maybe Captain Morgan, not sure. Maybe an old rum bottle, because is that Captain Morgan? Could be, I'm not sure. Did he wear red and green? <laughs> not sure. But it's a nice, nice design. This will clean up nice, and it's got a glass stopper. Here's another little project piece cup and saucer no maker models I do believe this is a ceramic just a little project piece this would be cute if you didn't use it for um, your coffee in the morning or your hot cocoa making an assemblage with it and here's a spade shovel bottle opener so there's a for the cap you use the handle that's neat, nice little barware. And that came with the set of six bamboo style spoons, mixers, cocktail mixers. Those will polish up nicely. It has this nice little bamboo style on there. Bamboo. Bamboo. Hey, she got me. Mm -hmm. um, here I have a 
off-white Chanel bedspread. It has, um, it's a twin, I do believe, and it around it has a little bit of a ruffle. So it's, what do you see? Right so here. Yeah, right here it starts to gather and it's just looser, like a ruffle around the three sides. So that was fun. Tammy picked up this like metal this. frame holder and brass like tone yes it's, it's brass and this looks like a candy dish like the cheshire cat no, I put now your tammy in there yes it has been repaired but it's a very good repair yeah they had saran wrap around but we'll it. see we'll see if we take a chance on I that i didn't see it but he's cute i liked it yeah if you're very very careful you'll never know just don't ever drop him also I have these little prayer, I mean, um, golden books. I picked up a just a big old lot of these. Those prayers, Mr. Bill's Fix-It Shop, Lady, um, the counting book, uh, count all, I don't know, count, I don't know, stickers covering it. What is this one called? Oh, count all the way to Sesame Street what that says and superheroes now I really got these because I want to do some junk journaling an Easter one home for the bunnies so I'm planning on maybe attempting that I got a bunch of golden books so I want to play I want to play and here's a hazel atlas oops don't want to drop that. that be like Get into the camera. It's a colony square design. Clear glass. Decorate as you want. Put anything in there for decoration. Tammy found these. Uh, your over 40 game. I guess they're playing cards, but it says your over 40 win. Your over 40 win. And one example is your over 40 win. You stop to think. And sometimes forget to, you stop to think and sometimes forget to start again. And that's what it says. <laughs> Another one is you participate in a ball game on Sunday and hurt until Wednesday. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. So days of recovery. So very, that's a, a two, two decks on that one. So I have this really cool a little container dish that slides open, rolls open, it rolls open. Uh, I am, I asked Karen, Miss Karen Williams about it because this is her forte. It has this little glass dish in there that sits in there nicely. And what did she say? She thought it was a butter dish and I was being real sarcastic saying, it looks like a caviar dish because it's so fancy. It's rounded and it just looks fancy and she looked it up and sure enough it was a caviar dish it's for caviar i was just joking y'all see sometimes i can get it right out of my sarcasm right it does have a little bit of patina on it it has a little lion face on the legs but um she might have told me the name of it i don't even remember now who the maker is there i don't even remember yeah there is a logo on the bottom of it there is a logo i don't remember what it says i can't see it but really cute piece i've never seen one of these before she's the one that started making me look for this kind of stuff we have this nice heavy crystal uh jam or saucer jam 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 jar, I would think. Jam jar, nice heavy crystal. And I don't think this came with it. But the little spoon, nice little silver spoon, comes from the Houston Club. A very exclusive mm. club in Houston. Maybe they stole that jam jar from the Houston Club. Let's hope not. Let's hope this <laughs> precious uh, elderly couple didn't steal this. <laughs> okay, what kind of dish is this? It's really cute. It's square and ruffled. 
That would hold lemons. It could still be a lemon dish. It's two handles. David, do you know what this one is? No. He's my glass guru. I leave it to him. Y'all can tell me in the comments below what y'all think this might be. Nice. Those are very clean. They may work. They're very pretty. Wait, this says for legs. This says for underarms. Oh, it says one side and then the and other? And it caught one of my whiskers. <laughs> Did it hurt? Yeah, pulled it. <laughs> Don't you get it? It says underarms and legs? Yes. Four legs, four underarm. Oh. <laughs> Girl razors, that's for the legs. And this side is for the underarm. Look at that, that's cute. I have one in, in my bathroom now, and oh, it does come out. But I was gonna say, it didn't have the um, the uh, cord to it. So, you can take the cord off. So you can display these if you wanted to. Of course you can take the cord off, you old poop. <laughs> it got my whisker. <laughs> it got you. It showed you. Hmm. Okay. So you want to plug these in and see if they work? No. We could do a demonstration on Davis. No, thank you. <laughs> got cords everywhere now. What else? What else, got? Tim? Um, We're at 31 these, minutes. We got these dishes. Oh. Boy, you were talking this time. Daisy and Button hat. These were years, well, I've seen uh, in some of the catalogs, they held the cigarettes. Put your cigarettes in here. I got another reamer. Clear glass uh, juice reamer. I don't know this brand. I don't know which one. I didn't look any of this stuff up before. We just had to get it off the floor. You know what? I could use this as a jewelry holder, too. Hold your bracelets. <laughs> pink, pink, you stink. Nice, two little nice depression glass flutes. Very nice little stem on there. I saved those at a Goodwill. They were just there for someone to just break and tear up. And then I got a set of one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, seven, eight, eight. Banded Depression Pink. Uh, what are these? Juicers? Juice, juice glasses. Juice glasses. Look how pretty those shine. Those are going to clean up very nicely. Can't believe it. I ate them. I think I left two because they had flea bites. These are pristine. Also, did you show this one? No. This nice pressed glass compote. Or can't, well, it's not a can't, well, it could be a candy dish. Oh, I got this one. I'm trying to open this. Very nice pressed glass compote. Norm. And here's another little uh, powder dish or candy dish. Powder dish, right? Mm -hmm. I don't think it's really a candy dish. Got all these bubbles, a thousand eyes. Now this Did lid, this? look, this lid does, ha is it supposed to be that way? What way? No, they're chipped, right? Uh, yeah. It has it's some chipped, chipped bubbles. It's missing some bubbles. It's missing some bubbles. It has it's a missing couple one, of... two, three, four, five, Show six. that in the screen. See the bubbles missing and the bubble. chip. Missing a bubble. Missing a bubble. Missing a bubble. Missing a bubble. But it was taped up. So That's the thing with tape. And it's we didn't tape. learn to pull the tape off. Here's a nice reamer, heavy duty reamer, ready to make juice. I showed that one. Oh, sorry. And here's Why a, are you putting them back down here? Because it, all this has been shown. Little angel, musical angel. It, it, well, I don't think this works. Oh, maybe it does. No. It does work. Little goat angel. Tammy found this nice blue West Clocks. It doesn't work. It has C's. Maybe a little oil and cleanup will fix that. Nice retro. I like that blue clock. 
alarm clock. And look, these are my favorite. Look how big that is. These paper mache uh, face uh, dolls, I don't know. This one's from Mexico, actually. It says Mexico. What is that other word? Capistrano. Capistrano, Mexico. Little vase for your fake flowers. I wouldn't put wet flowers in here. But it matches. I collect stuff like this in the um, paper mache dolls that hold your makeup brushes or lipstick. And I don't know what the big hoe is for. But I love these. I'm keeping these. These are mine. Here's a nice enamelware coffee pot with lid, and it has a Pyrex, there it is, Pyrex glass dome. I don't know if that's original to it, but that's a nice little marriage. So you can see when that's percolating, and also it comes with a nice matching enamel coffee cup. Literally just opening some of this stuff. Here is, I thought this was a cool little piece. It's a plastic set of um, snack trays, clear snack trays. And there's a snack tray, Starburst. And I don't know, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight in here. And they come in this little case. Very cute little set. Little snack trays for a party, a fancy little party. So Scott has a nice train set that he got from his dad. That was his dad's, I believe. And I found this nice deco lamp post and I thought maybe Scott would want it. And he didn't get back to me in time. He didn't want it. He said he had plenty of lighting, but I picked it up anyway. It was a good price. And I'll either take that with us when we next time we meet, or if he says no, go ahead and sell it, then I'll sell it. But I'll let him give me the go ahead on that. And look, I got these two little ceramic babies. This one and this one. These are going to go in my small cell. Cause Smiles. I like that small cell. A lot of people liked it. So we're going to try that again. So I'll save those for the small cell. And here is, I think I only found one of these. Very yeah, pretty. This one. Three candle. I think this is German. And no cracks or issues on uh, the glass here. Nice tone to it. Hear that? I hear it. Do you hear it? Mm hmm In space, no one can hear you. You scream. don't normally hear a lot of things. What? You. Yeah. Exactly. My point. Here's a nice bow. David picked this up. He found this. Little painted uh, purple. Flowers. Bow with. I cannot read. I cannot find my glasses either, y'all. Have not been able to find them in a while. Tammy picked up a little frame, the little vintage frame, and a hot. Is this a hot plate? Trivet plate? It's hot. Trivet plate? It's smoking hot. Yes. Yes. You can hang it on the wall or use it as a hot plate, but it's got mushrooms on it. Mushrooms. Who doesn't love mushrooms? I love this thing. In the pink, simply shabby chic metal Kleenex box topper. Kind of cool painted. Or you can wear it as a mask and rob your local bank. They'll never know it was you. And look at these really cool things that I found at the Goodwill. They're already framed. They're, uh... Oh, yeah, you went without me. <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> doll... Uh, you left me to babysit. Uh, well, 
I can't talk. What are these called? Words are hard, y'all. Um, paper dolls. Paper dolls framed in... Oh, it does have a date on this. I remember now. 1930. Is that 32? What does that say? Yes. It does say 1932 is a date on here. But there's not just one. There there's is two. two. Dolly, Dolly Dingles. Dingle. Dolly Dingles. Aren't those cool? Nice, heavy, sturdy frames, all ready to hang. Has a wire in the back. I this thought is these were really cool. Swartzburg. Swartzburg. Swartz. Swartzburg. Oh, the fox. I don't know nothing about the fox. I don't either. You picked it up. It's just cool. I a just, wood fox. I thought it was cool. What does he say? What does a fox say? Did you That's show it. this? Nope. Oh, I thought you set it down. You showed it. I guess you didn't show this? Nope. Manhattan Relish Center. These are hard to find. I found two. Keeping one. But here's the center. What is this? Hardest piece to find. What is this? Clock? What brand is that? Uh, Linden. Linden. Travel clock. Nice brown and gold tone. And what else? I guess, I guess Charlie's left. Oh, Charlie. Charlie's Charlie been bit me. So patiently. Does he work? Does he do anything? I hope not. Maybe his head will turn all the way around. I'm not sure why Tammy bought Charlie. <laughs> He's creepy. I now get, we take him I get to every of, estate, so... <laughs> I get out of bed in the morning and put him next to Davis. <laughs> what, Charlie? <laughs> <laughs> the okay. grandkids are going to love him. I'm going to have him sitting in their chair when they walk in. That's the second part of the major hall. Let Charlie, we're going to leave without Charlie and wait for the kids. <laughs> <laughs> Five, four, three, three two, one. one. If you click that and click that subscribe button click up there, there and then clip, click, click, give a big thumbs, thumbs up. up. Bye. Bye.